How y'all doing today? Good, how are you? Good. Doing great. So yeah, obviously missed you know, a lot of time at the end of last year. So what was that recovery process like for you and, and how's it good to be back on the field this spring and, and working full out? I mean, the recovery process was great. You know, I was just every day working, taking it day by day. I didn't really look to like a time stamp on it with the six months, this and this and that. I was just working day by day, working with the trainers who have been great to me. What was the injury specifically? Uh, MCL. MCL, gotcha. Sprain, torn? Uh, I was torn. Torn, gotcha. So how's it uh, for you now? Um, obviously, you're healthy, you're practicing, you're contending for a starting job. Uh, how's spring practice going for you? Spring practice has been great. You know, getting back in the flow. I love the game of football and just playing it just makes me happy. And how, how are you progressing from a... I guess the technique skill standpoint. Uh, I'm progressing very well. You know, just sitting down for a year, doing a bunch of rehab has been great to me. You know, just sitting with a bunch of people like Javo, Matt Lee, Jalen, a bunch of people know 5 0 line from last year, even this year. Just learning from them, taking every game in the piece and adding to my game has been great for improvement. How different does, uh, how different does this O line feel? Mario just talks about the size. Like you, you look at it now, you see dudes. How different is this offensive line? I mean, what do you mean by different? Different from like just like, like the, how what makes us us? From when he got here, from when he got here. I mean, I don't know really know how it was when we got here, but I know how it is now. Now we're just like, or at least how it is since I got here. We're just we're bonded, we're tight, you know, we're disciplined. Especially having a coach like we have, he just he gonna grind it into us. Be disciplined, be tight, run to the ball, move fast, be technical. I know this time last year. One of the points of emphasis for you was getting stronger, building up your body. So how's that process gone for you? Have, you? have you gained weight over the last year? Have you gotten stronger in any area particularly? Uh, I mean, I feel like I've folded out a little bit more, you know, toned up, you know, being injured, benching a whole lot when I couldn't walk has been great to me. I feel like my improvement really just keeping low on my body fat down and just getting more toned and getting more athletic. What are you athletic. weighing now? What I'm weighing right, right now, I weighed in today around 327. And what did your bench press go up while you were in uh, I haven't really maxed too much, but I, I, I definitely feel like on the field, I'm faster, I'm quicker, my knees feel good, my hands feel stronger. And we've seen you working a lot at, uh, at guard uh, this spring. Um, I know you play mostly tackle in high school, so just moving to that position, how's that been going for you? Uh, playing guard is just, it was a transition. It was a transition I, I, I love to learn, you know, because playing right next to someone, you want to know how they kind of figured it out. So I kind of knew before, but I had to really dial into it. And it was great to just learn the process of being a guard, learning how different the run game is that I tackle from guard. So. And you mentioned a minute ago, like learning from the older guys like Matt, Javo, um, Jalen Rivers, I'm sure too. Like, what, what are some of the things that you've learned from them? Things I learned from them are just like uh, in the passing game, be more patient, you know, shoot your hands, play half a man in the run game, stay low, get your hips in it, hands tight. You know, kind of seeing how they handle certain blocks. And also IQ as well, you know, knowing when like the safety's coming, knowing when like the DN might go in because the safety's coming, it's been great. Samson, for you, got some, you know, playing time earlier in the year last year. How important was that for you to kind of get your feet wet and you know, heading into this year, how big is that? Uh, I mean, that was it, was, it was, it was cool, you know, just playing a little bit at the end of the game. I mean, it was definitely just a great thing to do. How much do you credit uh, Alex Mirabal for kind of your development in this past year? Oh, I'm, I credit him a lot. You know, he's a great coach. You know, he's going to always just try to instill you, like, you need to learn the game. You need to learn how everything works on the field to really be great. And that's what I love from a coach. Just like not just doing your job, learning the whole five job plus the QB's job. You know what I'm saying? Because you, once you start understanding the bigger picture, you can move well a lot quicker. And that's how I've been moving a lot quicker. And then Mario Cristobal as well, like how much is he involved in your development and how much have you learned from him? Oh, a bunch. You know, sometimes uh, after a couple of reps, he, he might talk to me, say like a little bit like that. I like what you did there. And I like you could have did this a little bit that, that way. You know what I'm saying? And that's very great to hear from a coach. Just kind of coach you like within like the same time coaching you, you know what I'm saying? It's always great. And then we're going to talk to Markel Bell. Um, he's, a, he's a big guy. I just, what's, it, what's he like on the field? What's he like, you know, off the field? Ah, uh, he's he's a he's a dog on the field. The same way off the field, he's a dog. You know what I'm saying? He, he's a great, great person, great, 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 great um, teammate to have on the team. You know what I'm saying? Just being six seven, being long, you know, he has great advantages on the field.
you and Francis, I know this time last year, you, you guys were talking about how you feed off each other. I know that Francis is kind of sidelined right now, but is there is that dynamic still there for you too? Almost definitely. I mean, I'm talking to him. I'm talking to him like how we do this, how you do that. How would you do this? You know what I'm saying? Even though he's, he might be like injured and anything like that, he's still actively like getting better, you know, within mentally, you know, so I'm talking to him. How would you handle this? I might show him this rep, you know what I'm saying? How would you handle that? And we're kind of bad at each other, just talking, you know, playing immensely in our head. What impressed you most last about question. what he did last year? I mean, just how how he, how how instinctual he was, and how just he picked up the game so fast.